<laughs> there you are. Look at your little face. Look at your little face. Good morning, everyone. I'm feeling really stressed today. I think it's all... Oh, I'm out of breath, apparently. I think it's all catching up with me. I'm starting to panic that I just haven't got everything sorted for Christmas. And when the kids changed the little countdown calendar this morning to 10 days, and the thought that we're now into almost into the single figure countdown, that just really scared me. So I thought, right, today I have to really sort myself out and make lists. And because I'm doing Vlogmas, which I'm really enjoying and really loving the challenge of, it just means that the spare time that I would normally sit down and kind of think about what I've still got to do and plan when I'm gonna do it is taken up with editing extra videos and things like that. And I started off so well. I got so much of my shopping and organizing done in November and I thought, right, I'm gonna be really sorted in December and not have to worry about anything. But the fact that it's Marion's birthday on Sunday has also really snuck up on me. I wanted to get my hair done this week because my roots are just off the scale. They're terrible. And what else have we got coming up? My niece's birthday is today, which I haven't seen her for so long and I'm supposed to be going to see her this evening, which I'm really excited about. But that means I haven't got this evening to plan stuff either. So I'm gonna sit down, get a few bits done and hopefully feel a lot more organized by the end of the day. And this one, are you gonna help? It's about time you pulled your weight, young lady. You can't just be cute all day. That's no good. That's no help at all. It's a little bit later on now and I'm feeling a bit more organized because I've made a plan. It's not like it's absolutely loads. It's just like I was starting to feel like I was gonna forget something if I didn't plan it all out. I've just sat down to do something for one of Dan's Christmas presents. He doesn't watch my videos unless I ask him to specifically so I don't have to worry about spoiling the surprise if he watches this. So I'll show you what I'm doing. So this is what I'm doing and I'm hoping to get it done in the next half an hour but Dan is a massive fan of camping and I thought it'd be really cool to make a flag to use when we're camping with like a family coat of arms on it so I'm designing my own using Pick Monkey and it's going all right so far but I just need to fill in this bit with the coat of arms and there's a flag printing business local to us who said they can do it for me this week but I need to get the file over to them by the end of the day. So that's what I'm doing now. I think it's something he will really like if I manage to pull it off. Are you helping me? What should we put on the coat of arms? I'm thinking a beer bottle because that's one of daddy's favorite things. And that's it, all done. I'm really, really pleased with it. It's not perfect, but then it's a homemade gift so I'm hoping that once it's printed onto a flag he will really appreciate it. I think he will. I know it's a slightly strange gift but he's really difficult to buy for. He doesn't like stuff but he does love camping and he's really into his camping kit and just making it really homely when we go camping and I just think being able to fly this above our bell tent will make him really happy so I hope he likes it and that it looks okay when it's printed. Square. <laughs> This one is refusing to go to sleep. I've just laid down on the bed to feed her. She nodded off for a minute or two and now she's woken up again. And I was hoping that she might sleep so I could go and film tomorrow's video. Excuse me, mitts off. Just catching up on Mrs. Meldrum's latest video. Probably shouldn't watch any more haul videos because I keep wanting to go shopping again. She's still not sleeping, so I've accepted that it's just not gonna happen. So I'm gonna set up and film anyway. I've put on some red lipstick just because I haven't done my hair very well, so I'm trying to distract from that. So hopefully that will make me feel a little bit more festive and put together. I'm just gonna set up my camera, film a video, and then I'll have about an hour until it's time to go and get the kids from school. She's finally asleep. Wash your hands. That's everyone collected from school, and I look like a drowned rat with red lipstick on. I just picked up Dylan from school. What did you make today? Look how cool it is. Well, I didn't really make it today, but it's something that 
Um, me and one of my friends have been working on in school. Is now, it a space buggy? Yes, it's a space buggy for a pl for the planet Mars because um, we worked on um, making a space buggy for the astronauts to drive in. Yeah. And um, I love it. Um, in school, I made a We Do Lego, which is where it's Lego, which has engines on, where you can code it to make it move. Was it fun? Yeah, our our task was to make a, a space junk collector, and ours had these spinny things where it pushes the trash in. Yeah, like in garbage trucks, it has the oh, like it sucks thing, it all inside. Sucks it all in. That nap didn't last very long, did it? No. Now we're watching Trolls. Happy holidays to all, and to all, a good night. <laughs> Casually being serenaded by your big sister at bath time?